It's good to be with everyone again. Uh, today I'd like to talk about Psalm 27 and from Rosh Chodesh Elo through Hoshana Rabbah, Ladavid Ori is recited as well as sounding the shofar during this month. The custom to recite this psalm is based on a midrash. The midrash says, Hashem is my light on Rosh Hashanah and my salvation on Yom Kippur. He will hide me in his shelter, which alludes to Sukkot. The implication is that on Rosh Hashanah, God helps us see the light and repent. And on Yom Kippur, he provides salvation by forgiving our sins. Once we are forgiven, he shelters us from enemies and dangers, just as he did for our ancestors in the wilderness. Because of this allusion to prepare for repentance and its aftermath, the custom was adopted to recite this psalm, as I mentioned before, from Rosh Chodesh through Hashanah Rabbah. The psalm describes David Amelik's response to crisis and himself attempting to deepen his connection to God, to seek shelter and protection, because he was always involved in wars. Another aspect of this psalm is the king, referring to God, is in the field, waiting for all of us to become closer to him. Without a doubt, this is my favorite psalm for its beauty, fragility, and hope. And if I may, I'd like to quote part of it. It says, One thing I ask of Adonai, this I seek, to dwell in the house of God all the days of my life, to behold God's beauty and visit in God's sanctuary. And in the conclusion of this beautiful psalm, it concludes with Lule Hamanti Liro Petu Varonoi Beerz Chaim, Kave El Adonai Chazak Yamesli Becha, the Kave El Adonai. If only I could trust that I would see God's goodness in the land of the living. Place your hope in Adonai. Be strong, take courage, and place your hope in Adonai. Psalm 27 encourages us to do work of opening ourselves little by little, day by day, to prepare for the goodness that comes. I hope by taking five minutes a day reading the psalm in Hebrew and English if you're able, will serve as encouragement and inspiration and introspection throughout the coming holiday season.